it was real, it was a real heady time to be there. And we had, uh, you know, it was a question of anyone who knows has been an entrepreneur, you're trying to create a new business. And this was like, well, let's take the two things that the, what was then people 12 to 34 years old, which was then the baby boom generation. We're almost forgotten about them now. But the two things they love the most, music and television, put it on TV in a new way. Without, in those days, they played music videos, which no one had ever seen, in a radio type of a format, song after song with a lot of fancy interstitial imaging kind of uh, uh, on-air promotion work. And um, we had everyone telling us it wasn't going to work. Cable operators wouldn't carry it because they said, who wants to watch music on television? Advertisers said, you don't have an audience. The record companies, they didn't want to give us the music videos. And everyone said, that's really a bad idea. That's really a bad idea, the idea you have. But, you know, the people who were working on it, we were fanatical. That we said, this is a fantastic idea. Who's not going to like this? You know, of a certain age group, a certain audience seg segment. And ultimately, that turned out to be the case. So